Thanks, everybody, for coming. Today's a great day for Kent State University and Kent State football. Uh, there was a lot of people put in a lot of work to end up with this class of 25, and our staff did a phenomenal job of identifying and evaluating and cultivating relationships to get us to the, the uh, 25 guys that we brought in today. It's a fabulous class. We have 14 from the state of Ohio. We have two from the extended state of Ohio, which is western Pennsylvania, and then we have nine from out of state. Uh, se seven states were represented. Uh, the breakdown was 13 on offense, 11 on defense, and one in the kicking game. We used 33 of our 56 allowable visits to yield these 25 guys. Uh, of this group, there are 20 captains that were our captains on their football team, 20. Uh, seven guys will represent us in the North-South game, All-Star game. Two will represent us in the Big 33 game. And this was a fabulous group. And really, when we started this process back in February 27th, 2011, the three questions we asked ourselves were for this group to, to come to Kent State were, one, what are the, what's the character of this group do, do we want to have here to, uh, for us to represent our university? What is the character? And uh, you'll find that these guys are, have impeccable character. Two, we wanted guys that we thought that could flourish in the classroom. And three, guys that could bring this university championship team. So uh, those were the criteria that we used and set forth as a staff. And like I said, our staff did a phenomenal job of getting out, getting away from their families, and spending time on the road cultivating relationships that uh, we were able to yield these guys. And I can't be more excited about these 25 guys. You're going to love them. But uh, when you meet these guys, you'll be very impressed because they are special. I think that was big to get guys that, that know how to win. And uh, I think there was four or five guys that were either on a state championship team or a runner-up championship team. And like I said before, there's 20 of those guys that are captains, which says a whole lot about their character and their work ethic and all those things that goes into at the end of the day when you're fighting and struggling and hard to win football games, those are the things that rise at the, at the end of the day. We're here to win football games. That's why we're here. And at the end of the day, we're going to play the best players at all positions, 22 special teams, to give us a, a best chance to win the championship. Competition's great, and uh, you can't get enough competition. And guys looking over their shoulders, that's a good thing. And the guys looking to their side, that's a good thing, uh, because it puts a little bit more pressure to get in and watch more film, to lift an extra weight, uh, to run that sprint a little bit harder the next time. Uh, so competition's excellent. Athletically, probably a lot of them can play right away, athletically. But it's going to be how, how well they uh, apply themselves to learn our system. That's the biggest thing I think we talked about as a staff is, is creating team toughness. That's one of our goals in this off season is to make sure our team grows together. No matter what the situation is, we keep fighting. And uh, so that's one of the things that we'll try to develop. But I think with this new group, they got to fit in and uh, hit the ground running when they get here in July and make sure that they understand that they're fighting for a position and they're fighting for a championship. Our last year was stressful. Um, with three weeks, you really can't get to know the guy as well as you like to, the families and, their, and what kind of food they like and the dog that they have to go home to and all those things that you need to know when you're recruiting, recruiting guys. So we had a full year of eva evaluations of the families and the kind of character he has. You're able to ask the custodians in the high school, what kind of kid is this guy really? Um, so that full year makes a world of difference for you. You know, you can say, you can walk into someone's school and say, hey, we're getting hot right now. And this, now's the time to get on board. We, we won four out of the last five games, and it's only going to get better going forward. So uh, that was critical for us to, to get hot in November. You know, with the, with the close proximity of all these bodies that are coming into this class, you're gonna, you're gonna, your attendance is naturally going to go up. And you got guy, 14 guys from Ohio and two from Western Pennsylvania. Naturally, you're going to get more people in the seats. 
and I feel pretty comfortable that we're going to put a good product on the field that the guys are going to want to come watch us play. And buy your season tickets because we need you in the stands. Thank you. And, uh, again, I want to thank everybody that helped us in uh, recruiting this great, great class. We had a lot of guys, not only on campus, but uh, downtown and the hotels and the people that fed us. They all did a marvelous job, and that's why this day came to to be the way it is. So thank everybody, and go Flashes.